So welcome to the series of Oracle Fusion Middleware video lessons. In the first uh, video of Oracle Web Center Portal installation, I have covered uh, the installation of infrastructure, Web Center Portal installation, then uh, repository creation utility for the schemas, uh, followed by the domain creation. And uh, we started the servers also. Now we are pending with one step that is you know verifying the URLs of Web Center Portal. Let me open the WebLogic Admin Console. Uh, if you have not uh, seen that video, you have you can see the video on the YouTube that is uh, Oracle Web Center Portal 12.2.1 installation. Let me go to the WebLogic Admin Console. And here, if you go to servers, you can see three managed servers uh, are up and running. That is WC Collaboration, WC Portal, WC Portlet. Uh, first one, we'll try to see the Web Center Portal managed server URL. I have the URL with me. This is what uh, the host name and the port number of manage server so it will take some time to open so meanwhile I'll, I'll tell you this this is what the WC portal if you go inside inside deployments you can see the deployment called web center so this managed server has this deployment web center this is called our portal builder that this was uh, earlier they used to call it as in web center portal spaces now they call it as oracle uh, web center portal builder just go back and see the wc portal this is what and the port is 4h so we have opened the host name with the port and then the URL, the context route in short, a web center. So this took you to a web center portal screen. The default username is weblogic and we set the password as weblogic1. Let me sign in. So once if you see the screen and you're if you're able to log in that means you are uh, good with the web center portal managed server so let me go and test the other managed servers as well so i will cover uh, some of the concepts on web center portal builder in uh, you know following videos i'll upload them in in the same channel let me go to wc collaboration So WC collaboration is in 8890. So this is what a collaboration, the URL is OWC discussions and it is available in 8890. Collaboration, if you go inside, you can see the OWC discussions deployment. And mainly this is for uh, discussion forums and announcements. I'll open the browser and I will say, you can enter here. So this is what your a discussion forum admin console let me try to log in here so that i can confirm this is available for the discussion forums creation weblogic weblogic one is my default username and password so when i log in it says welcome weblogic so that means you're good with even this server so that is called your OWC discussions, that is called WC collaboration. So that means we have verified two managed servers, WC portal, that is for the portal builder, WC collaboration, uh, that is for the discussion forum and announcements. Here you can create the announcements and uh, here is the forum. You can create the new forums and this is only for admin console. Admin console of your uh, discussion forums and announcements and let me verify the third managed server that is wc portlet which is running on 8889 
so there are three urls mainly to verify this manage server is properly configured so i'll test one by one the first one is portal tools and the second one is wsrp tools i'll open one by one then i'll explain page lets the third one see this is the third panel server inside this you can see all these deployments whatever i am trying to open the first one is slash portal tools which has the omni portlet producer and sample portal producer we'll use uh, you know this will will i will explain maybe in, in upcoming videos about this omni portlet and sample portal producer as well if you go to the second url that is wsrp tools uh, this has and i can some importance i'll i'll try to cover even even about this also in coming videos and the page lit producer so this is what the welcome page for this producer you can see the message if you are able to see this, see this then that means you are you are good with the installation so that means you verified all these three urls as well along with along with the other discussions and web center so with this you can confirm your installation is successful and you have all the servers up and running on standalone mission so let me reiterate uh, so we started with the uh, infrastructure installation followed by web center portal installation with this is actual product installation and then we we ran the rcu that is a repository creation utility uh, to create the database schemas and then we have created the domain for web center portal so this so that this is the domain wcp domain which has all these managed servers and admin server so we started the servers all these uh, managed servers and admin server and then we have we have just verified all the urls so with this we are done with the web center portal installation second video thanks thanks for watching